So, from the shofar of the Messiah, know that this is through the, disse the dissemination of the true wisdom, so they will evidently see the true God and true law. The dissemination of the wisdom in the masses is called shofar, like a shofar whose voice travels a great distance. The echo of the wisdom will spread to the world over, so even the nations will hear and acknowledge that there is godly wisdom in Israel. Yeah, it means everyone will feel that the Creator is revealed in those who are drawn to Him. Yeah. Go ahead, again. Again, number three. Know that it is through the dissemination of the true wisdom, so they will evidently so they will evidently God and the true law. The dissemination of the wisdom in the masses is called shofar. Like the shofar travels a great distance, the echo of the wisdom will spread the whole world over. So even even the nations will hear and acknowledge that there is a godly wisdom in Israel. Questions? None. Okay. In other words, we are called Israel, Yeshua Kel. And in the end, our direction and our inclination and mainly the dissemination that we try to do, well, let's hope each of us tries, because by this he corrects his uh, function uh, in the world and is rewarded with uh, kind of attention, relation from the Creator, because the purpose of creation is that they will all know me from the least of them to the greatest of them, as the Creator says. So one who brings all of humanity to that state, he is called Yeshakel, straight to the Creator, Israel. And then he he will reach it. Those who don't add to it, put into it all of his efforts and concerns, then as he says that it can wait, that the world can wait, so he can wait. This is what they think about him from above as well. And he will progress accordingly. As Baruch Salaam says, I was rewarded with what I was rewarded only thanks to my generation, because it's a generation that's worthy of the coming of the Messiah, and everything he did, he did for this. 